All right, YouTube, we're on day four. It is coming to an end. Not hungry, still haven't had anything to eat. I even put myself to the test. Temptationville, if you will. Walking through all types of street food vendors, the grocery store, didn't give in. Still not eating. Yes, tomorrow will be day five. I'm gonna do a day five. On day six, I'll weigh in in the morning, and that'll be the final results, and I'm gonna get some food, okay? So, tomorrow will be the last day. Now, let me break down what happened today. Enjoy the show. So, here I am, getting a little uh, walk before hitting the gym. I wanna, I wanna get some pre-walking exercise in. Oh, you see the headphones. What am I listening to, you ask? Well, here you go, Keto for Normies. Give them a listen if you haven't. That's the Keto Connect crew. I know you know who they are if you're into keto. All right. Uh, yesterday, what happened yesterday? I strained my lower back. How did I strain my lower back? Good question. Well, during the squats, I went a little too heavy. Boom, that's what happened. So I've been up uh, last night before hitting the bed. Uh, what could I do to, other than lie in bed and do nothing? Freeze your fat away. Oh, yes, I have to try that. Okay, back to the lower back. Uh, yeah, I hit the YouTube. Got some good advice from some mentors I look up to. And I'm going to hit to the gym, put it to good use, and I'll, I'll talk you through it as I do it in the gym. Is that a Pizza Hut lurking around the corner? Oh yeah, temptation is kicking in. Mmm. When's it? During the holidays, this this is what I did. I did Pizza Hut. They had a naughty pizza special. I so tore into that naughty pizza special. And you gotta be keto 24-7. So during that holiday I took a break. But I'm back on the keto fix. Woo! Looking good. All right, let me take a break and hurry up and get to the gym. All right, getting my mandatory coffee after checking in. And I just catch up with Alpha Destiny just to refresh my memory of what I'm supposed to be doing up in here. Check his channel out if you haven't already. Good, great advice. I've made so many gains with this guy. You gotta check him out if you haven't. Mm. All right, Athlean X. Great tips, thank you. I'm putting it to use today. Let me say both of these men's tips have helped me greatly. My back is feeling good. All right, first thing I do, I hit the treadmill. I max out the incline, just like walking uphill. I'm not walking outside because it is rainy over here. I'm not trying to get wet, and it's working. This treadmill is doing a good job. Then I move on to some stretching. Oh yeah, I haven't did this in so long. But as you can see, my range of motion is not very good. It's not because I'm not putting effort into it, it's because my lower back is killing me. You can't see right there, but I can't even touch my toes. All right. Oh yeah, this is it's feeling nice. This stretch right here, real nice. <laughs> oh, I do my best, but it just, Range of motion, hold my leg up like this is killing the lower back, but it's all good. It's all for progress here. All right. You can see my, where my fat, my little fat store is left in my thighs there. I've lost a lot of weight, over 
Well, I'll talk about it later a lot, but I still got some left in the thighs there. It'll come off when it comes off. All right, this stretch right here. Oh yeah, feeling good. I was thinking I couldn't do these, but I did them and it, I'm back. I handled it and I'm feeling great as I'm talking in this microphone here. Oh yeah, some good stretch on. So this is basically not even a GPP day. This is just a, a light day in the park focusing on lower back repair. All right, one of the tricks here to do was to put some heavy weight on the lap bar and just get a good stretch going on. Like kind of like you're hanging from a pull-up bar, only in you know, a different direction here. All right, then I followed up with some reverse hypers. Out of all the exercises I did, this one felt the best for my lower back. I'm sure they all work, but this felt the best. All right. Then I go into Temptationville. Look at this. Oh, yeah. Cheap and delicious. Not giving in. There's some keto in the mix there. Not all of it, but some of it. Mm, mm, mm. It is food smells so much better. I don't know if it's the fast or what, but my senses are kicking in. It's like, wow, these things. Twisted potato french fry. It's all in one little ring. Looks so cool. All right, let's get down here. All kinds of different food available. Mmm, looking good. Get some shopping if you want to get some shopping in. I need that for my phone. All right, some more snacks. Mmm. More chicken around the corner. Always the chicken. Here we go, donuts. Followed by some baked goods. Oh, wow. Smelling real good. Loving it. I used to eat that. Oh, I used to eat a lot of that stuff. Cupcakes, love baked goods. Now here's my go-to place. Still didn't give in, nope. Nope, I want it, but I'm not eating it. Not today. All right. And as always, thank you for watching. Comment, like, subscribe, hit that notification bell, and see you in the next episode.